Yeah, well, we last held the World Professional Championship here in 1934. Um, so obviously it's been a long, long time. Uh, and it's just, yeah, it's fantastic to have it back here in Melbourne at such a brilliant venue um, with the very, very best players in the world here. Yeah, absolutely. I think we held the IBSF Championships here in 98, which was um, a great event as well at the old RACV club. Uh, but the, the, the professional, the WPBSA or WBL event, um, as you say, we haven't had here for you know 80 odd years or whatever it is. So, look, it, yeah, it's it's great, um, and we're really lucky that the the real cream of the crop have come from all over the world to be here, and probably the strongest world world championship field for a long, long time, if if ever. The conditions are 12 out of 10. Um, we've got the new Strawn Superfine cloth on the beds, which makes them really, really quick, uh, really, really reactive and obviously you can play every shot in the book if you're a little bit out of position. Your soft stun shots and your soft screw shots um, are all very, very playable on these conditions. Um, and the 30 ounce cloth on the cushions um, is perfect as well. I think if the Superfine was on the cushions, they may be a little bit too, they probably slide and skid a little bit too much. Um, but yeah, similar to the Pro Snooker where they put the 30 ounce on the cushions and the um, the number 10 on the bed. So probably similar, similar playing conditions to that. So Allcox, obviously the number one table fitters in Australia for over a hundred years. Um, so George Taylor and Les and his crew there, wherever we go around Australia and play where they do the tables, they do a brilliant job. Um, and uh, as a player, you couldn't ask for nicer conditions. So 24 grand bonus for a thousand break. Look, it's never been done before, so However, it is possible on these conditions. Um, there's, you know, Peter Gilchrist made a couple in competition, Mike Russell, um, I think Advani's made one. No one's made one under the balk line crossing rule. So, look, it's odds against, no doubt that it's, um, you know, more unlikely than likely, but wouldn't it be great for the game if someone did it?